government to introduce Manipur Nursing Homes and Registration Act to check quality of private clinics in the state. Family Welfare Department is making efforts to achieve 10% immunization under Mission Andradhanush. Genim Society regularized service of Professor M. Ango and Professor L. Devind on February 19, 2015. At least four students injured in protest against construction of electric power station on Yairipok High School campus. Hello and welcome to Impact News. You're watching Primetime English News and I'm Premi Thangjung with the top stories and latest news at this hour. Director of Manipur Health Service Dr. O. Ibomcha today stated that the government is working on amendment of Manipur Nursing Homes and Registration Act to ensure quality among the mushrooming private clinics in the state. Speaking to media at the press meet organized by DIPR, in its premises Dr. Ibomcha said, planning to club small private clinics and hospitals and convert them into a multi-speciality hospital is incorporated in the drafted build. He maintained that absence of a particular department in a private hospital will be of no issue if 10 to 15 such hospitals are clubbed together and provide all the facilities under one roof. Dr. Ibomta also added that licenses of many private hospitals were cancelled after government doctors were found working in these hospitals. Advanced Hospital Palace Compound faced the faith, but the license was restored after the hospital authority assured that they will not employ government doctors. <laughs> Masih masih penis tak kita punya apa masih kontrol tak baik. Amat dia harus mak kau legendary. Aduh mana bah departmental disciplinary action law bah. Aduh kan magi registration kap bah. Aduh ki punishment dia kau pilih kita punya apa kau ki lazy. Sehingga proof leh kerja di. We can initiate any inquiry against any defaulting doctor. Instruction law ini punya kerja. Aduh kamera so ayam malu ni panah kau. Aduh kan report so tu pilih leh. Ada hujan faham di masih mama ayah kum jelah ceng mana kan dikari ni kan di particular wibah masak si kui mana yang kamu ceng mula kau itu pun baru angkut jauh di orang tu mui na hana screen taro tharap pun ada mula kui dia lama baru aku makah explore taru hana jari. As per instruction of the High Court of Manipur to check government doctors working in private hospital, a private hospital were asked to install CCTV cameras and send the footage monthly. He said no government doctor is yet found working in private hospitals. Dr. Ibomcha also maintained that lack of manpower makes it impossible to perform operations in district hospitals other than Churachanpur, Thaubal and Senapati. Replying to a media query, Dr. Ibomcha said State Health Directorate is just a member of Food Safety and Standard Authority of India and it functions out of Secretariat which makes it difficult to check hotels and other eateries for safety standards. He also said a strict norms will be needed to curb the open sale of tobacco products in the state. No one is allowed to use ultrasound machined without registering as it can determine sex of the unborn child. All machines which can determine the sex of unborn child have been registered with the authority consent under the Preconception and Prenatal Diagnostic Technique Act and Rules. Director of Family Welfare Dr. K. Raju asserted that if hospital of private clinics are found using them without registering them, they can be punished under the Act. Addressing the media at the DIPR premises today, Dr. Dr. Rajo said to reach out to the unvaccinated and partially vaccinated children in the interior areas, the department is taking up immunization works at a grand scale under Mission Indradhanush. He said the main objective of the mission is to achieve 100% immunization by 2020. State Task Force Immunization Team has been formed under the guidelines of the Government of India. Electronics Vaccine Intelligence Network event was also produced under United Nations Development Program by supporting manpower at state and district level for smooth implementation and improving efficiency of vaccination system at all the primary health sub-centers, primary health centers, community health centers, district hospitals and state level hospitals like Jawaharlal Nehru Hospital and Regional Institute of Medical Sciences. Preconception and prenatal diagnostic technique and high. 
masih Malaysia ya masih koi gi hujikan dah yang nasional ni bah nupa masa nupi masa kang tu oga nupi orang nama mangan bah nupa orang nama thaming bah asyik bagi puas eh masih makah dah koi yau ni si beti pasau beti parau kai na lagi kan koi gi ruh misal nanti orang program pun nama si ya koi gi periphery dah lagi bah nasi four hundred twenty one subcenter le masih menung dah two seventy five subcenter ya koi family Welfare ini makah dulu. Seru ohum topogi seru ini dia koi family welfare di bawah mengi makah dulu. Maksudnya sub center meyam sini dalam lembah enam singsi na masih ye program kodi maksa. Ruhel misi nabu arsu, he nabu arsu, family welfare nabu organsu. Tahun ini program sih makoi ye nurse singsi na loin implement tawa. Ibu naisa kata tawa bukan tawa. Ewanes kata tawa bukan tawa. Ngasagi asagi tawuk su nurse tu kalu ini nata tawa mina ba. JNM Society in a special meeting of the Governing Council in the CM Secretariat chaired by the Chief Minister had resolved to regularize Professor M. Ango, Dentistry Department and Professor L. Devend, Physiology Department on February 19, 2015. Dr. T. Rajan and Dr. M. Shyamu were not regularized as they were receiving pensions from the RIMS, while Dr. H. Lokendro was not regularized as he had crossed 65 years and was drawing pension from RIMS. Speaking at a press meet at the Chamber of Genims, Director today Dr. Y. Mohan, Head of Pathology Department, appealed to the underground outfit which has called for a 24-hour in connection with several issues relating to Genims to withdraw it in the interests of the people. Dr. Mohan said there are official records of the regularization of Professor L. Devend and Professor M. Angoba. He also maintained that their services were regularized according to the MCI criteria and after the approval by the search committee. Genims Director Professor L. Devend and several doctors and staff of the institute also attended the press meet. Search committee in the Khangra Bokambu say was the 21st Governing Council, 19 February 2015, 19th, the Governing Council resolution number 10 of the Yawra Mihajari ba Humpu Manga ki makhaadhe lai ba di khara regularize chau ba hendo khara di yaada ba hai ba du ki category du da Dr. Ango Bukha, Dr. Debian ka si Governing Council na Eprobian pi khara ga regular ba na thok ki ba ki record si press mai aamda ba ki director saab na thambir ga ni Singna la ba ho na zari ba institute amma ki wa thok oe ra ga la lo lo amma na ba na ta u ni ka in ta u bi ni se Kupna Perjaya Singhi Khandha Virga Tau Bidana Baina Press Media Aki Thongda Apil Tau Zaman JNM's authority in its efforts to strengthen the bond between doctors and patients distributed switch to the patients of the hospital. Director Dr. L. Devind, Dr. Y. Mohan, Head of Pathology Department and several doctors and staff of the hospital distributed switch to patients. Speaking to media, Dr. L. Devind said the Genims Authority is doing its best to make Genims a better institute and hospital and sort for people's cooperation. Genims are thabuk tokjiri ba doktor singh chiga, aruga ana ba singh chiga, koi gi amatani, koi family amatani, communication ji khara lai nana bahai badi, koi na oloi support tokjiri. Genims are lakpiri ba ana ba khuding mokpo koi na misang khai nai dana, regi amama tokjana tokjabana chade, koi phajana tokjagani, koi same treatment pija gani, aruga koi na Kau na suki mati kiar logje ya betul, aduh gigi panam mamu ina kau na ngasih jenims ki doktor sin sina, yang musuh yang musuh kau na kerak kau musuh sami naba, kau musuh thami naba, aduh gigi panam da relationship panan naba, mari panan naba, understanding dihe na lain naba, ngasih kau na sanjin jaba atau pa new kongtang amni. Newly elected President of Bharatiya Janata Yuva Morcha, Manipur Pradesh, P. Somojit and President of Kishin Morcha, K. H. Nabukumar were felicitated at the Wangu Sabal Mandop today. The reception was held by Youth Committee of Kumbi Assembly Constituency Polling Station No. 26 and 27. At least four stu school students have been injured in the protest against construction to often power station on Yaripok High School campus yesterday. Police arrested three members of the JAC in connection with the protest. Yesterday, around 12 noon, students of Yaripok High School launched protests against the installation of a power station on the school campus. The de they damaged the temporary shade used by the laborers. 
Personnel of Yairi Pok Police Station fired into the air to disperse the agitating students, injuring two of them. The protest became intensified after police arrested three members of the JAC formed against insulation of the power stationed on the school campus. Students stormed the Yairi Pok Police Station and shouted slogans demanding release of the arrested JAC members. Scuffles occurred between the protesting students and police personnel. Two girl students fainted in the scuffle and they were rushed to Yairipok Primary Health Center. The situation in and around the school has become intense after students opposed the construction of the power station on the high school campus. Police personnel are keeping a strict vigil to prevent untoward incidents in the area. Sources said the JEC members were not released till late last night. Today National Seminar on India's Act is Policy, Problems and Prospects in Northeast India begin today at Indira Gandhi National Tribal University Regional Campus, Manipur. The seminar was organized by Department of Political Science and Human Rights and sponsored by Indian Council of Social Sciences Research. Three papers were presented at the first session today. District Magistrate Imphal West has prohibited assembly of five or more persons which is likely to turn unlawful carrying of stakes, stones, firearms or weapons of any other description or objects which can be used as offensive weapons in the district under Section 144 of CRPC 1973 with effect from 6 p.m. tonight until further orders as an immediate preventive measures. A 15-year-old boy identified as Moirang Tembidyananda Singh, son of M. Jibon Singh of Hairok Part 2, Pujari Chitek, has been missing since the 14th of this month. He left home in the morning of July 14, around 6.30, on a red hero cycle. He was wearing red trousers, a blue half shirt and white slippers when he left home. He is about 5 feet 3 inches tall, fair in complexion and had short hair. Southeast Asia Cultural Organization CECO has appealed to all concerned to not call for band or block it on August 4 and 5 as they will be celebrating the Foundation Day on these days. As a part of its outreach free health camp program, CJ Hospitals in association with Don Bosco School, Maram held a free mega health camp on the college campus. Free OPD consultation for pediatrics, general surgery, medicine, dental, ENT, gynae, I, along with free ultrasound screening were the highlights of the camp. The main objective of the health camp was to reach out to the poor and needy living in and around Maram. More than 500 patients were screened during the health camp. Let's take a short commercial break. We'll be right back with more news updates. Stay tuned. Upon the fitness center, the sense of money will be quite a job case price or river six state level transformation challenge 2016. Pactu Sergani Agastaretta preliminary round November through the final round line in a grand final November time to the competition as it hung given on the Masagi room by hand by the what from your singer Masagi normal wet at Hamduna Chung Firal Java Changam Nabani Sergiabu first poisons one lakh second poison forty thousand third poison twenty thousand fourth poison ten thousand five poisons five thousand. Welcome back after the break and you're watching Primetime English News. One Day Awareness Program on Ill Effects of Drug Abuse was held today at Emmanuel English Academy, Yangang Pokpi. The program was jointly organized by Narcotics and Affairs of Border NAB and All Manipur Students Guardian Organization. NAB officer in charge R.K. Bikramjit said, People are already aware of the effects of drug abuse among the youth. He said it is necessary to raise awareness among the people about the ill effects of drug abuse to eradicate drug abuse. Then family, then like guys, society is it. When 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 punjal lakanda, away away lakanda, when drug abuse, 
Principal DM College of Teacher Education has notified that a special admission test for admission to be at first semester for the session of 2016-17 in college will be held on July 24th at the college from 11 a.m. to 12.15 p.m. Deputy Director of the Department of Minorities and Other Backward Classes in a press release informed the beneficiaries of EDP Poultry Scheme 2013-14 to collect delivery slip by July 25. JEC of all Manipuritan test successful candidates in Fall East today submitted a memorandum to the MLAs of the district demanding declaration of their pending results. Police Constable Mail Civil 2013 batch before July 17th. The JEC submitted memorandums to Wangkai MLA Y Irabod, Kundrakpam MLA TH Lokeshwar, Tongjang. MLA, TH Biswazit and five other MLAs of the district. The JEC said they would intensify the agitation in case the authorities turn a deaf ear to their cries. It may be mentioned that the results of 10,287 aspirants have been kept on hold. Hatak July Tazigi, that Sabentin Mamang, the Traga Sabentin Pawi Manunga, Hana Bababo, Sil Loy Graba, DBC, is an also equate to Biona, Quen Hana, on Evans, Yemdos, and Hajaki, Tazabazi Hana, Mana Matan Jay, Toy Token Lare, Adubo, Aqua, the Anova, Deadline, Ama Pibs, Aqua, and Niger Roy, Aqua, Aruba, Jessica, Aruba, Deadline D, Zahizigi, Liberta, July Tazigi, Tang Taraga Taret. Hayeng Sibawi Manung, the Aquai DBC is an out of Dragadi, Aquai Jessica Saitagam, the old Manipur return test, successful candidate Saitagi, Aquai Sarkargi Saita, Makal Makaka, Aquai Toning the Ba, Aquai Togokayama Tolokpa, Yai. A book on Tangta, Tangta Giwa Role, written by Mutum Arun Kumar, was released yesterday at a function held at Ipatho Kok Sanglin in Naram Thong. Several people, including lovers of martial arts, took part in the book launch. Khadi, as a symbol of self-reliance, played an important role during the independence movement in India. Keeping in view the relevance of Khadi in sustaining rural weavers and artisans, even during modern time, Khadi and Village Industries Commission KVIC, following an order by Government of India, has appealed to all functionaries and employees of Manipur to wear Khadi once a week. Yoga teacher training camp will be held at Patanjali Yoga Pit Haridwar Uttarakhand in two batches from the next month. Interested yoga teachers and instructors in Imphal West can get the detailed information from Bharat Swabiman Trust, Imphal West. Gabby's Cafe, a family restaurant, was opened at Technopal on Imphal More Road today. DC Chandel Robert Singh Ketrimayum inaugurated the restaurant launch under the guidance and sponsorship of Classic Group of Hotels. Speaking at the inaugural function, owner of the restaurant, Tempi Kongsai, said the restaurant is opened with an aim to help travelers, especially women and children, visiting Mori. DC Robert Singh said Technopol has become an important place after the Centers Act is policy and Gabby's Cafe is an example of positive development. He also appealed to all pub like to support the restaurant. It is policy ki positive development sa ibat ay kasi ubo pang bagi tanjado adumak kasi witness to unay na yaisin ngi. Gabby's Cafe is not just simply a cafe. It symbolizes the success story. It symbolizes all the hard work. Kung gisimak unay na ba kona ba da kung na lawi ba thodang siya na thagan na yawi ba. Example number one, we give them be long hands at passing the zoo. I am the Nungai ba potabam, ma pibi ba. Zagasi ba zoo hena fazan ba. Tourist sport ama zoo hena pibi ba. Ki youth sing the zoo. Suba no makan ba ki dumba. Ma pam pibi ba si. I am the thagan ngai ni. Music Club of Manipur University today organized cultural rendezvous Tunes of Manipur at the Centenary Hall of University. The event was attended by Vice Chancellor, teachers of the university, renowned artists of Manipur and students from various educational institutes. Kongjong Parva by N. Ibening Devi, Pena Pamsak by K. H. Mangi Singh, Fusion Music, Kabui Folk Music, Kom Folk Music and Kulang Ishai were the highlights of the cultural event. Ishai. Mewah ibu sama aja ni. Tongan tongan ibu mewah puruk puruk nama ki. Tongan tongan ibu saya lay. Maaji, apa ibu macam apa? Kena aja kerana itu, kerana itu, tongne, kerana musi ne, kerana apa? Macam kalsa, ibu ibu sih masih pop music sih dah yau.
Petrol price has been cut by rupees 225 paise per liter and diesel by 42 paise a liter. The new prices came into effect from midnight last night. Petrol will now cost rupees 60 and 67 paise a liter and diesel will cost rupees 52 and 74 paise in Imphal. This is the second reduction in rates this month. Indian Oil Corporation, the nation's largest fuel retailer, said the current level of international product prices of petrol and diesel and rupee US dollar exchange rate led to the decrease in the prices. Before we end, let's take a look at headlines once again. Government to introduce Manipur Nursing Homes and Registration Act to check quality of private clinics in the state. Family Welfare Department is making efforts to achieve 100% immunization under Mission Indradhanush. Janim Society regularized service of Professor M. Ango and Professor L. Devend on February 19, 2015. And at least four students injured in protest against construction of electric power station on Yairipok High School campus.